when the work done on a body by a net force is equal to change in kinetic okay what is the heading work energy theorem four marks very very important Work energy theorem. What is that work energy theorem? The work done on a body by a net force is equal to change in kinetic energy. Okay. So work done. Work done. How we are? What is the actually work done means? Work done. So uh, when we can say work is done. So suppose let us take this part. This object is there. So is there any work? Is there any work? no work it is at rest position okay now what happens uh, suppose it is moving from this point to actually it is like this so after some time it is it went like this how it went so now i am applying some force what i am applying some force i am applying on this object then what happened it is moved in this direction let us take that uh, place is changing actually supposed to be at this point what happened after some time it is went this point Okay, without applying force, the object will move. No, it won't move. It will be at the same position. If I apply some force on this object, then the place is changing. Then what we can say from this? So, work done means force and displacement. Then only we can say that is a work done. Okay, suppose let us take best example the brick, uh, the, the uh, load of bricks are there there at one place one labor came okay we said okay carry these bricks okay as soon as he said the carry uh, load of bricks will go and stay there no see what he will do he had to uh, he has to carry the one, one brick from one place to another place how oh, so when is if he want if he wants to carry he has to apply the force then the place also changing then only we can say the end of the day we can say the bricks are not there at that place the all bricks are at this place then we can say work done so work done what is the formula actually work done in the what is the first letter w so if you want to do work done means what all things we need definitely we need force into force into displacement or place changing displacement so our cross product we can say so here what is that this is our general formula but here what is that the work done on a body a net force is equal to change in its change in its kinetic energy so what we can write the work done means what is the formula w is equal to what we can write 1 by 2 m v square next 1 by 2 m what we can write next one m u1 square v1 square next m u1 square okay this is our formula work energy theorem or else what we can write next w is equal to ke final velocity next ke next this is initial velocity the both are correct only if you write this one or if you write that one both are same only okay now next proof how we can prove work energy theorem okay let us consider mass let us consider the mass let consider mass okay it has definitely some velocity v velocity will be there now that may be uh, u or u that, that it has some velocity okay it is moving one direction so so if you want to move that uh, mass from one place to another place what all things you need definitely you have to apply the force then for if you apply the force what happened definitely it is moving okay what is that formula w is equal to again Mm, force into mm, what we can write work work is equal to force cross this placement okay force in the what we can write next cross product displacement how much we can write yes w is equal to okay but okay, we know that equation of motion from equation of motion
motion v square minus u square is equal to 2a yes already we know this equation so v1 square and u1 square okay which value i need actually i need this value what i want this is v1 square minus u1 square is equal to 2a sorry which value i need s value i need yes what happened then equation 2a okay this is equation number one this is equation number two okay next from newton second law from newton second law what we can write f is equal to m a this is equation number three okay substitute the f and m values in the equation number one substitute 3 comma 2 in 1 substitute equation 3 comma 2 in 1 then what happen w is equal to hmm. f how much is there m a is there next what is the displacement hmm. v1 square minus u1 square by how much is there that is 2a then a gets cancelled then what happened 1 by 2 m v1 square next m u1 square by 2 next w is equal to what is that 1 by 2 m v1 square next 1 by 2 m u1 square okay then or else what we can write w is equal to what is this kinetic energy this is initial or final this is the final then what we can write 1 by 2 m or else uh, simply we can write this ke final minus next ke initial okay in this way we could prove that work energy theorem what is the work energy statement the work done on a body by net force by net force is equal to change in its kinetic energy or different changes in kinetic energy this is a work energy theorem very very important for four marks okay if you didn't get four marks you will get one energy theorem and along with that you will get one problem okay next topic next topic now we are going to discuss about the potential energy